All right, everyone, so it is 2023. I know by the time you are watching this video, we might be a month in, two months in. I don't know when I'll be posting it, but I'll be posting it shortly. <laughs> All right, my name is Nicole. If you're new here, this is Pipiana Magazine, and it's a Latina lifestyle magazine. Sometimes you'll see me, sometimes you'll see other people. We celebrate everything Latina. So I thought for this new year, me personally, I wanna get back into working out and being consistent with it. I feel good after I do it. It's just not the thing that excites me the most. You know what I mean? Where you just sort of feel like I don't want to do this. Also, I feel like a lot of people tend to work out when they don't like themselves or like their body. And personally, I don't hate my body, right? I know it's not like the ideal type, but I'm happy with it. And so there's just really negative feelings when it comes to working out. So I thought a fun creative way to move past that is to look into celebrity workouts and in particular Latina celebrity workouts and see what do they do to stay fit and maybe it'll be something I enjoy doing and if not it's just fun content. There we go. So I decided for um Originally, I was going to be like, I work out like this celebrity for a whole week. Then I realized, you know what, Nicole, you're just starting to work out. So let's just do like, I work out like this celebrity for a day. Let's just try it for a day. All right. The first Latina uh, celebrity workout I do for a day is Ana de Amas. So in my research, I found that she liked, and let me look at my notes because I will forget. She does a combination of Pilates, soul cycling, some type of cycling and boxing and of course meditation so i felt like the weather well a lot of things she does is indoor sorry so i decided for the day i'm gonna go back to soul cycling because i've done soul cycling i enjoy it i haven't done it in months so i was like let me do that because i know what it is and i can just go into it boxing i feel like i will have to try to find like a gym around here and then pilates i haven't really done pilates and i've done yoga I haven't done pilates so that might come in another video and of course meditation and i decided to go to a meditation center instead of a just doing meditation at home so luckily i live in la so there's a lot of soul cycles and there's a lot of meditation centers. So I went to the one that's closest to my house, which is in Brentwood. And then I went to um, Unplug Meditation Center. I saw it in another video, it was beautiful. So this is what I did. All right, so because our girl Anna loves to do cycling, I decided why not I just do so cycle. So haven't done it in a while. It used to be something I do all the time. Haven't done it. And so this is the card professional. It's like I feel really good. I feel rejuvenated. And now on to meditation. And I found this place. It's four minutes away. It's, it is so L.A. It is very... <laughs> Meditation and sound bath. So we're going to go check that out. All right. So I just finished my first meditation sound bath class and um, unplugged. It's on Wilshire um, in Santa Monica, and it's, you can't take your phones in there, so I just got my phone back in, and it was just like, I got to lay down in a dark room, listen to sounds, and just sort of like, it was lovely. Now I need coffee, though. So I did an Ana de Amas inspired workout for the day. I might continue doing it for the week. Actually, for the rest of this week, I am going to go do yoga. And so it inspired me to continue my workout. So I'm really excited. So thank you, Ana, for that. And if you guys enjoy this, I am going to be doing more Latina inspired workouts. I am going to be doing... Um, jenna ortega so she is the actress on wednesday she does about she does a combination of yoga and hiking 
So we will see. That might have to wait until the weather's a little bit better. All right. See you guys around. Bye.